Hello everybody, today I'm going to teach you how to do a stop motion in Google Slides. If you hadn't seen my other two videos about how to create a Google Doc or how to create a Google Slide, I'll leave that in the description below. So, um, to go to um, Google Slides, I'm on the Google homepage right now. I'm going to click the um, menu button which looks like a waffle next to the images on the right hand corner. And most of the things I do are um, always left click. I mean, mostly left click. Now I click Google Sites. Um, before I created a um, presentation called My Story. But I want to start a new presentation. So I'm going to click the um, plus button. And as the, as the name, it says blank on the bottom. Now we came to the slide. My presenta um my presentation is going to be bird flying. That's going to be my stop motion. So I'm going to add a theme. I think I'm just going to stick with white for now. I'm going to put bird flying and I don't need a subtitle box or if you might need it you could put it but I'm gonna delete it good now I'm gonna put slide and new slide so then after the title page I get this one but we can't do any um, we can't do anything with this layout for the stop motion so we're gonna go to layout and we're gonna click blank now we're over here. To put your background, or to insert your background actually, you click insert next to the view button. And then you go to images, and click search the web. And then, um, you're gonna type for my stop motion, I'm gonna do for forest. Ooh, I like this one. So I'm going to click it and then I'm going to click insert on the bottom. Now it came. So I'm going to, and then I'm going to use the dots to increase the height. Good. Now for, um, for the bird flying, I'm going to need a bird. So I'm going to go to um, insert image and search the web. Bird. Always, always, always include dot PNG or else some white background or other things might come. Uh, let's see here which one looks better uh let's see which one yeah maybe this one looks good so i'm gonna click the bird image and then i'm gonna click insert oh my gosh this is too big so i'm gonna um and it also has a background i don't want that so i'm gonna go back to insert image search the web and then I'm going to choose one without a background. Maybe... For... Um... Yeah, I might like this one. Let's see about that. Yay! It came. So... I'm going to keep it outside the white line. And now to create the stop motion, you're going to, um, after I'm done putting my image over here, I'm going to go to slide, duplicate slide, and then now um, I have a new slide. This is slide two, this is slide three. Looks the exact same. So click on your um, photo and then click the uh, arrow two times. I mean, click your, um, click your right arrow two times good and then I'm going to keep doing that
and then slide duplicate slide click that do two times slide duplicate slide click that do times slide duplicate slide I'm gonna click the um right arrow two times again and again until you're perfect but to make it like fly you could put slide duplicate I mean not delete slide I'm gonna click that do button slide duplicate slide and then I might put it up and then side slide duplicate slide 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 duplicate slide I just keep doing that so mostly the minimum I mean if you do it like um normally like the birds flying and building something it would minimum it would be like a hundred but you could also do um, small stop motions like I'm doing today so I think that's good and enough for me now let's let's see I'm gonna scroll back to the top and I'm just clicking the right arrow to do it uh, I'm gonna do a little more so I'm gonna go slide duplicate slide two times slide duplicate slide up up side and then I'm gonna keep doing that while I'm almost done and then after this I'm gonna teach you guys how to publish it to the web so instead of clicking the right arrow it'll automatically play it um I'm just gonna do like three more slides probably good now as you see just from flying over here all the way over here took me 31 slides that's quite a lot now I'm gonna inst and then I go to the top instead of clicking the right arrow like as much of slides as you want like for me I instead of clicking 31 times uh, there's another way to do it that automatically can play it for you click the file button right next to the edit and view button right next to the name and there's all these options click publish to the web next move to trash but don't click move to trash it's going to delete your slides click publish to the web and it says uh, most of these options so every three seconds um, as for me, it, um, I would stick with three or five because if it's every 30 seconds, it's going to be like too much. So I'm just going to keep it as three. So I also click start slideshow as soon as player loads. If you want the slideshow to go again and again, then click restart the slideshow after the last slide. And I want that. Don't click any of these things. And I'm going to click publish. Yes, click OK. Hold on. Cancel. I'm going to check one thing. Yeah, we don't have to touch those. Publish and OK. Now I got the link. I'm going to click it, put Control C and Control V, or else you could put con um, Command C and Command V on Mac. Control C. Control V. And then you see this 3000 over here. And I'm going to change it to um, about 300. And then I'm going to click enter. And I'm not doing anything. It's just automatically coming. And then that was the last slide. So it restarts again. So those are all the steps you need to make a um, stop motion video if you love if you like this video please hit the subscribe button and the like button below thanks for watching hope you like um, the stop motion
Bye.